Well, there are always resources available for anyone who would like to talk with someone. You can find more on that on our website, westernmassnews.com. Now a story you'll only see on Western Mass News. Faculty at Hampshire College in Amherst speaking out about low morale at the financially struggling school. After staff layoffs were announced earlier this week, some professors are wondering when their jobs will be on the chopping block. These faculty members spoke exclusively with, West, with uh, Western Mass News. Reporter Audrey Russo has the story. There are faculty that have been there for 20 years and suddenly to find out that they may not have a job within five months. Hampshire College faculty say whatever clarity they saw in the school's vision for the future has been clouded with recent layoffs of advancement and admission staff. There was no room to propose other ideas and we feel like our hand was kind of forced. They tell Western Mass News that the layoffs are just another example of how faculty have been left in the dark about the school administration's recent decisions. By announcing that we might not take a fall class, it effectively made it so we couldn't take a fall class. There was no clear plan about how we can maintain our current student body. Nobody knows which departments and which faculty is going to be staying. I've been getting these questions. Are you going to be my advisor next semester or not? I tell them, flip a coin. The decision of which faculty are going to let go has to be made by April 1st because pre-registration starts. We reached out to Hampshire College to see what the administration's plan was for faculty layoffs. A college spokesperson got back to us saying, quote, the college has not made decisions yet on faculty layoffs. It's likely some faculty members will be affected by layoffs to be announced in April since we'll have fewer students next year. There have been financial issues. We had no idea, though, of the extent. Hampshire is still looking for a financial merger, and so far only one school has publicly identified identified itself as a potential partner. Western Mass News took a look at the minutes from UMass Amherst's faculty senate meeting. There, the UMass Amherst chancellor stated they were in talks with Hampshire College about merging. However, the chancellor made it clear that any merger with Hampshire would have to generate enough revenue to keep their tuition prices stable. Probably in the range of 30 to 50 percent cuts, layoffs. What professors say is clear is that they could soon find themselves pounding the pavement, freshly broken from contracts they thought would be the foundation of long careers. You lay down your roots and you expect in some ways that you are going to retire at that institution. In Amherst, Audrey Russo, Western Mass News.